I mean, I have to just bring this up right out the gate because it's been <laughs> 15 years since you first worked together on the beloved franchise High School Musical. And now you guys are back together again for this new Christmas movie. So you got to tell us, how was it working together once again after all this time? It was Bliss. magical. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was amazing. Yeah. It's just, just, just so easy and so fun and so i mean just just to be able to work with your best friends really does make a difference yeah and i think too you know so many people obviously know us as chad and taylor and that can at times you know make you think that it really is just about the characters and what's so beautiful is that this experience has shown us that you know we we brought those characters to life the same way that we brought lucy and barrett to life and i think it just kind of reignited this understanding of just how just much chemistry and how beautiful our relationship is on and off screen. Mm -hmm. I love it and we're so excited to see the film. So tell us why is this one to watch this holiday season? Corbin we'll start with you. I mean it's got everything. <laughs> uh, it's it's a, obviously it's a Christmas movie and it has got lots of Christmas in it. Um, from the, the, the joy and the, just the art department too, by the way, I, I know I complimented your, your beautiful, uh, Christmas background earlier, <laughs> and it really does make a difference just to get you in the season. And it was same thing with us, our, the art department on this, on this project was so wonderful and, and us being able to be surrounded by this winter wonderland mm -hmm. got us in the spirit, which was wonderful. Um, and then it's a dance movie, uh, and you have the two of us dancing together again. uh and then do christmas music <laughs> do christmas music uh and then of course it's a, it's a love story um which i is to me is just the root of of the the movie um and there's so many i i think there's there's so many elements to that that make this particular movie special or or you know magical and and i think that, that a lot of that is is monique and i's history uh, and our, the fact that the chemistry that you see that kind of pops on the screen is just us. Like we really, like <laughs> we've known each other for 15 years um, yeah. and there really is such a love there. So, so that made that really easy to do. Um, but also, you know, you, you have, uh, I, I, for me, I, I especially, I know, and I know a lot of Lifetime's lineup this year too, there's, there's so much representation. Yeah. Um, and I love that in this particular film, you know, it, it is, yes, we are represented and it's diverse, but the backstory of it all is just, it's a romance and, yeah. you know, it's not the, 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 the diversity isn't necessarily the driving force behind the storyline, um, yeah. but it's all there and you have, uh, you know, such a, a wonderfully represented cast. Monique, did uh, Corbin leave anything out? Because I think he... He hit all the marks of why we need to watch it. <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, I mean, it's just, it just feels good. <laughs> you know, just like plain and simple. I feel like it, it just, it feels good. And uh, it, it's a movie that I think will bring you all of that nostalgic feeling and one that you can watch over and over again. Mm -hmm. Well, we are so excited to finally see it. But now, why this project? Because you guys, obviously, we know you have the chemistry, the on-screen chemistry. You guys are still so, I mean, you're still close, it sounds like. After all yeah. the time, you're friends. We've seen on social media, you guys have reunited several times. So why this project? Why? Because I'm sure there were others in the past where you could have reunited then. Go ahead. Yeah, I, I was just going to say, you'd be surprised. That's actually not really the case, you know? Yeah. And I think that that's a wonderful misconception to kind of debunk right now is that, mm -hmm. you know, you, you experience this enormous success and it's amazing, but in some ways it can also be limiting because even the way that the fans continue to see us as these characters, I think even casting directors and people in Hollywood also feel that way. And we've since grown up and I'm excited that this project is going to give people an opportunity to be satisfied by seeing us on screen together, but really seeing us as the adults that we are. And, you know, we're both married. We both have these very beautiful lives. And one thing that I think could possibly be true is the fact that I think sometimes we think 
think things have to be hard. And especially as actors and as artists, this industry is so mean and it can be really difficult and challenging. And I think on some level, we expect that. We expect things to be a little bit difficult. We expect you know, to be passed over and to really have to fight for things. And this movie, you know, coming together for this project specifically reminded us that when you really love the people that you're working with, when you care about the words that are on the page, when you care about the person behind the, those words, you really make something that is so much more magical and special than when you're, you know, in these other situations. So just like High School Musical was like catching lightning in a bottle and it was just this magical thing that just kind of happened and then, you know, showed us, this is very similar. It really just kind of came together and has shown us how magical our connection is, how much people really do love us and want to see us together and how much we want to do more of this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So, so well, uh, yeah, Corbin, do you anything going off of that? Because I, that was, I'm like that shaking was so my head. I'm like, well, <laughs> while Monique was talking, I'm like, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. She, she, she's completely right. I mean, you 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 would be surprised. I mean, I, I I think if there's ever been an approach, it's always connected to High School Musical. It's always to either come back and realize right. those roles, or it's you know something in within that world. Um, but for them to to approach us and to to have us yes obviously there's there there are some there are winks uh mm -hmm. just the fact that you have us dancing together and that you have um you know th this reunion but yeah. uh we are playing different characters and we are yeah. actually getting a chance to 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 show ourselves in in a, in, a, in a much more adult setting so it's it's uh mm -hmm. It's it's I'm I'm surprised that it hasn't happened sooner, but I, I think it's it's kind of perfect that it's happening right now. Yeah. yeah. That yeah. makes sense. I mean, as a fan, I'm like, I'm so surprised, but that makes sense. I mean, you guys, it's two different characters, two different roles, but no matter what, you guys are gonna be able to have that on-screen chemistry. It doesn't have to be related to high school musical whatsoever, but you do have this fan base that's already attached to it, which it's kind of nice, you know, you, yeah. have, you know, people are going to be watching because they can't wait to see the two of you on screen together again. Absolutely. And Lauren, I just want to also add that in many ways, our characters and their journeys have also been similar to Corbin and I's. Just to speak to why we haven't come together, you know, Corbin has continued to, to do amazing Broadway shows and just so many projects. And for a period of time, I actually kind of left the industry. I went off and became the United Nations youth champion. And I traveled the world and got married and really just created this life that was outside of entertainment um, because that's also very important to me. And very much like Lucy, I had to regain my confidence in myself and believe that I could even, you know, stand next to Corbin again and, and to, to do this artistic, you know, I love you so much. You're like, girl, stop. But it's just true, you know? It's like, <laughs> like so much of... Uh, the thing I is, I so know that that away. is your journey. I, yeah. I know that, and just knowing her, I, I know that that is her journey, and, and, and I know that th there was that, that trepidation. Mm, um, yeah. But... You know, I the thing is, is I just I I know what she's capable of, and I was there was mm. never a moment that I doubted. So <laughs> just like a, for me, it was just it was just such a, a a beautiful thing to know that that I have her to trust in. And I know I don't want to keep looking back on High School Musical because you guys are That's moving okay. forward. But is there any is there a world where you guys would revisit your beloved characters? Because fans always. I mean, hello, look at me. I'm like 27 and I'm st I am still love High School Musical. So is there a world <laughs> that you would revisit your beloved characters? I, I, I can answer and, and say that, you know, as long as it's done in, in the proper way, you know, <laughs> I, I, I think that, and so and a great example is, you know, the new High School Musical, the musical, the series, you know, yeah. where, where uh, they have done such a great job at, you know, kind of tipping the hat and also having like a little bit of a, 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 a meta world. Uh, and also it's, it's an, it's in an, it's in a new light, but it still has the integrity of, of, of the originals. I mean, and I, and I think same thing at, at the end of the day, you know, it's been 15 years since the first one, Mo, Mo and I are not the same people <laughs> that yeah, we were back. True. 
So uh, if there ever was a world uh, where there's a, a revisitation, it would have to be it, aligning with with who we are now in our in our person now. Yeah. Yeah. I will say though, I did have an idea once. You know how they do the live performances and stuff like at the Hollywood Bowl where they recreate stories. I thought it would be really cool for the 20 year of High School Musical to do a live in person at the Hollywood Bowl one night only, like, you know, full live orchestra, dancers, the whole nine, just like us, you know, uh, coming together again to to just be in celebration. I think that that's something, something like that would be just very unique and really special. So I'm just and, throwing and that out there in case yeah, anyone wants to say. Very <laughs> Let's uh, throw this out into the universe because yeah, you know, you know. out with that and I would be in the front <laughs> row really enjoying myself. So <laughs> we're throwing it out into the universe. But until then, yes. we have this Lifetime movie that fans are so excited to see the two of you guys in. If you could describe it in one word, what would it be? Corbin, go first. Joy. Joy. Ooh, mm. nostalgia. Yeah. So please tune in to a Christmas dance reunion this Friday, December 3rd on Lifetime.